Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Magic and Miracles, where you learn how to be the magician of your life. My name is Anna, and I'm your most favorite manifestation life energy coach under the sun. Reason why there is no such coaching program like my coaching program because I've designed it myself during the last nine years that I've been a coach. And no coach on planet Earth spends as much time with another clients like I do. True story. All the information for me is below. If you want to be in coaching with me, you need to pre-book, sign the coaching agreement by hand, print your name, date it, and scan it and send it back to me in an email together with your earliest availability. Uh, recently, I've included um, another package that can help you on a monthly basis and it's called on the go uh, the standard package is called the signature package with 12 sessions a month um, this package i recommend two to three months in coaching with me it's very productive to spend this much time with somebody who's done it already themselves um, and can walk you through the steps of how to revolutionize your life, how to shift your manifestational game for good. Now, on the go is less sessions. It's seven session, sessions per month. And it's for somebody who either is literally on the go or, quite frankly, for somebody who has been through my coaching and wants um, a kind of package that is a maintenance package. Okay, I've had those requests and basically um, these are the scenarios that uh, would be appropriate for this package. Now, in this um, package, I do not know yet how much time it will take you to cover my coaching program, given uh, that it's less sessions. So it, it basically becomes that it depends on the situation. It depends on where you are in your manifestational game. But if this is your lifestyle, if you're on the go, if you're busy, and you can handle two sessions per week for the first three weeks and then one session the fourth week, this is the package for you. In between, you still have access to me um, via emails and texts um, and um, audio messages if need be. If you have any questions, either comment or even better, email me directly or just pre-book um, and reach out to me uh, with your earliest availability to schedule a first session. Now, I'm really inspired to record this and this is my third go at this. <laughs> And hopefully I will not be interrupted um, this time around. And here's the thing. Um, <clears throat> sometimes there is a question in people's minds. Can you do it on your own? Can you do it without a coach? Right? And the thing is this, <clears throat> and people write endless posts on Reddit, how you don't need a coach and coaches are all, you know, I don't know. It, it's, a, it's a scam. They're frauder, fraudsters and this and that. So here's the deal. I can only speak for myself. Um, I'm very well aware of kind of like the unhealthy environment that the majority of coaches on YouTube have unfortunately created um, for people and the, the many... Um, I don't know how to even say it, inappropriate experiences that people have had um, and can cert and it's certainly valid, but I can only speak for myself, okay? Um, what I would say is that, of course, it's possible, okay? You could do this work without a coach, naturally. I've done it. The thing is, though, is that how much time do you have, okay? Um, how much time do you have to dedicate to this? Because the people I coach, they have a lot going on. They have busy lives. They have children. They have marriages. Um, they have companies to run. They have this. They have that. They they have a life already busy enough so that you know for them it, it's an additional job. So basically, when you're hiring a coach, understand a good one that you resonate with. Okay, and. It's, this is why I always say go with your intuition. Research this coach, what they're all about, what is, are they talking about their own success stories? And by all means, by the way, parenthesis here, when you hire a coach, do ask them questions. Just like, you know, I mean, I understand that this is an investment um, for a lot of people and as, as well you should and ask questions, always ask questions to um, the coach about things that you want to know about them, but definitely research. But here's the deal. Um, 
you can do the work, but it's going to take you um, years. You know, it took me years to perfect my methods first for myself, um, then obviously for my clients. And it's a never ending kind of like upgrade uh, that I have going on and I'm constantly tweaking things. And this is why I have become the expert. Okay, coaching people during the last nine years. I don't expect for everybody to want to do this. I just wanted to do this. I had a natural inclination towards doing this research. I've worked for myself for the last 13 years. And, you know, <clears throat> working for yourself is rather fabulous like that. You know, you have time to dedicate. And if you have got the passion, then that becomes an entirely different thing. However, again, the time aspect of it becomes very crucial because how much time do you want to spend on this? Or do you want to go to somebody who's a professional, who's an expert, and who is going to condense all the knowledge and all the expertise that they've accumulated, okay, in two to three months in coaching for you and spoon feed you this information that you didn't have to run around and find on your own. And I feel like that's what becomes. Now, number one, of course, as I already mentioned, is that you do have to gravitate towards this person. And again, like I always say, trust your intuition. Your intuition doesn't lie. Energy doesn't lie. If I know from my own experience the kind of people that are attracted to me because of who I am, because of what I share, okay, about my story, etc. The kind of style um, that, you know, that, that they are attracted to, to the style of my personality, to my confidence, etc. There's a certain reason that I have the clients that I have, which I'm really just magnificently pleased with. Um, never get tired of, you know, saying that and never really can say enough good things about my clients. They're just absolutely fabulous and really just blow my mind. On occasion, I'm not going to lie, from YouTube now, you know, not never before. I just, you know, have to be honest. I've had um, a couple of clients, like two or three, that were so resistant towards change. Um, and, you know, it, it was very kind of like an experience of uh, where I got disrespected because the resistance was so huge on their end towards the change that even a little suggestion of thinking differently caused a, a major disagreement between us. So this is why what I mentioned in life, <clears throat> look, if you're convinced that life is against you, like there is no wiggle room of negotiation there, you're not my client, I am not your coach. I don't want to work with people like that. I don't. I think people like that sincerely, like with all due respect, need therapy. And I have compassion. It isn't that. It's just for me, it's literally impossible to fish you out of this uh, depression. I'm not qualified to do this. You're going to have to meet me halfway to want to come with open arms, with open heart, with open mind and completely, you know, suck up all the knowledge that I'm giving you, that I'm spending my energy and time on to to give you everything that I've learned and everything that, you know, I, I've, again, accumulated the knowledge of, you know, probably since 12, because I teach magic spells in my coaching, I teach energy work, <clears throat> which nobody teaches in their coaching, I can tell you that, because uh, well, <laughs> I've, I have clients that have been previously with other coaches, some of the, you know, coaches you know about, and the stories I hear are hideous, quite frankly, I'm not even going to like exaggerate. Um, <clears throat> and so the, the second part of this becomes then the choosing of the coach. So it isn't that there aren't any good coaches out there. It is that the majority of the coaches have no business being coaches, just simple like that. And I had interactions with some of them, and you all know who they are. And I can tell you this much, that they're more concerned. Um, they're thinking that the perception of what they look like, what they appear like, the likes, the subscribers, the this, the graphics, the this and that, um, it's more important than who they really are. And this is what I just said is 100% true. Much to my complete disappointment, because previous to me having this channel, um, I mean, this is all new to me. I, I had no idea that <clears throat> people are completely full of shit, you know, and some of them 
exactly their coaches have no business coaching and privately they believe something completely different that to me was completely shocking and that <clears throat> their priority is solely um placed on what they appear like this to me is shocking and continued to be shocking so in that I agree that, you know, all of this kind of rotten, um, I don't know, preconceived notion that some people have about coaches has been affected exactly by coaches like that, but the, by the bad apples, by the majority of people getting into this business for all the wrong reasons, mainly to be liked and have money, you know, that they're being paid for uh, telling them, you know, what they heard from Neville Goddard mainly, I mean, that's what the story really is. Talk to them in private and it's a completely different situation. They don't live their teachings. Uh, their personal life is not, you know, like if you ask them about their personal life, it is not at all like what they are teaching, not even close, okay? This is completely true. So in that, I completely understand this reservation of why would I hire a coach and it's such a, you know, negative um, kind of reputation already going into it. So do your research, do your research, but there are good coaches and yes, you do need a coach if you need to do it <clears throat> And I would hope to God that that's your goal because <clears throat> why do it anywhere, anyhow else other than in a, in a fast-paced way? Because, you know, again, who the fuck has years to create their manifestation, okay? You need to go to an expert and it's ever so nice to go to somebody who's done it 50 million ways before and understands exactly what needs to happen in your situation. I don't know. Like, do you go to I don't uh, somebody like uh, if you were to renovate your house, let's just say, are you going to do it yourself or are you going to go to somebody who's done it like 50 million ways before? Just saying, right? And the other thing is that, of course, it's tied with money. Um, but here's the deal. In my own case, again, can only speak for myself. Let's just take my um, uh, signature package for, as, uh, as an example. It's $31.50, right? I meet three times per week with my clients. Um, that's 12 sessions. In total, it's 36 sessions. Now, this is ample time for me to really affect you. Lots of people excel in this time, either within my coaching, uh, towards the end, right after, maybe a month later. There is diff I mean, the person is just different. Okay, they start manifesting things, I, like I said, either within my coaching, which is very um, kind of prevalent, very often, the shift has begun. And so they start manifesting things that they want towards the end also, okay, or right after within kind of like days of finishing my coaching, or maybe even a month or a couple of months later. The idea is to receive this shift. OK, now you cannot like you can put uh, the kind of like the money aspect of it and say, OK, Anna, but thirty one fifty times three is almost ninety five hundred dollars. Right. So if you're looking at the number and you're going, right, that's almost ten thousand dollars. And, you know, that's a lot of money for me. Let's just say somebody says, OK, if you're looking at it that way, yeah, I agree. But if you're looking at it from the point of view of this is an investment into my life, this is an investment that will last me a lifetime if I show up and ready to work and do all the things that Anna is asking me to, just homework and work on yourself and be diligent. Don't just wave your hands up in the air. It's not going to be easy in some moments, but it's definitely fucking rewarding as shit, okay? And if you understand that, and if you completely then can grasp the idea that within my coaching, you will manifest money, you will manifest the job that you want, you will manifest your SP, you will manifest the shift that will last your lifetime, and you will know exactly what to do for the rest of your life if you ever get in this position, or how to alleviate this position, or how to even you know deal with certain situations just going forward, then it becomes an investment that quite frankly pays tremendous dividends and and this money that you invested will return to you like, I don't know, a hundred times fold in some cases. People manifest within my coaching money like left and right. 
okay? This is why they can quit their boring jobs. This is why they can start their own companies. This is why they can start their own businesses, blah, 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 blah. In other words, this money will return to you like quadruple, quintuple, a tenfold, a hundredfold for sure. And in, in some of the cases in my coaching, I have created millionaires. This is true story. Okay. So again, compared to a life changing event and bringing back your SP and creating abundance and being authentic to yourself, $9,500 now doesn't sound like a lot of money, does it? Just show up and do the work and then continue the work. Okay. Is what I add. Now, if you don't get what you want, you're in coaching with somebody and you're realizing, you know what? This is, you know, this is, this coach doesn't know what they're talking about, basically, which I've heard these stories. Then it's an, it's a different situation. Obviously, any money spent on somebody who doesn't know what the fuck they're talking about is money not well spent. It's a waste of fucking money. So in that, I agree. But you need to look at it as an investment. And provided you find the right coach, then it's worth every fucking penny. You know, and again, in my coaching, I keep talking about it because it's so true. I have yet to hear anything comparable to my coaching um, with any other uh, coach out there. And again, I hear stories in my coaching all the time. It's not because I'm bragging. Just please understand. It's not about me who's bragging on my coaching. It's about just really being excited of what I can accomplish with my clients, uh, the way that they take things seriously, okay? But I set up every single person that comes into my coaching uh, with all the tools necessary that they need. So it's not just DSP. I teach you magic spells. I teach you energy work for sure. This, this is yours. Like as a part of my coaching, I go through this extensively. Okay. Every step of the way. I mean, needless to say, the belief prescription, reworking, the drama, trauma, panorama reworked and processed. Um, this is a huge part of what I do. But most importantly, you have your life set up as far as your business also is concerned. As far as your money is concerned, we address everything. So by the end, I mean, literally in my coaching, I even teach how, how to set up a website for your new business. It's no coach does that. Like no coach does that. No coach does that. And I always follow up. How are you doing? Do but do even after the coaching is done and you leave the coaching with all of the tapes um, of our sessions, obviously for you to re-listen to. No coach does this. Like literally no coach does this. It's, it's a very transactional situation. So for you, you need to understand where are you in this kind of, um, uh, on this topic. Um, yes, I would recommend to get a coach if you can, um, this will, this should be a one-time event. This shouldn't be hopping from one coach to another. It should be that this speaks to you. Um, and this is the other thing, you know, like as an example, um, right now on my channel, there's something going on. Uh, I don't know what, what it is. I haven't gotten to it yet. I have emailed YouTube and this and that. But for whatever reason, my views, they're not what, um, what they actually are. They keep dropping. They, they rise and then they drop. They rise and then they drop. And something weird is going on. It doesn't bother me. Okay. I know eventually I will fix it. I know how many people actually watched. So it's some kind of a glitch in the system. Maybe they changed something. I don't fucking know. Now, I know for a fact that the coaches that I've interacted with, um, that you all know this would be a fucking priority. Okay. They would be all over it. They would be freaking out. They would feel so ashamed. They would all this fucking shit. Okay. I know for a fact that this would be priority number one for them. For me, it's fucking not. You know what the priority is for me? To channel, to help people, to really zero in on, okay, have I given enough today to the people that are in my coaching? Have I like really channeled this message the way that I wanted to channel? In other words, being your best, showing up and doing your work exactly as you should be doing as a coach who knows what the fuck they're talking about. In other words, is the information information up to par or it's, you know, or can I do more and this and that, or how can we improve and maybe this and maybe that. 
the attention should solely be focused on the quality of work, on the on the kind of coach you are becoming, the kind of person that you are, not the fucking likes, not the fucking views. They're going to work themselves out. It's, you know, whatever. The technology is crazy like that, which is why I don't particularly like technology, but whatever. The main idea, the main dish should be the material, okay? The content, as everybody says, to me is just material. What are you delivering to your clients, to your audience, etc., etc., etc.? Not the fucking graphics, not how you edit your video, n- n- nothing, okay? Not nothing, okay? It should be about information only. And if you ain't getting this information, and if you heard this same shit regurgitated uh, of Neville Goddard and Blue Blah Blue and whoever else, like there's nobody else that you know ever kind of came up with a, a brilliant thought and by the way Neville Goddard's teachings are not complete this is so kind of obsolete to keep regurgitating Neville and make it like the one and only you know teacher that has ever had you know these kinds of ideas it's incomplete he doesn't really t- teach energy how energetically you're supposed to change yourself in order to you know man- keep manifesting these things so that part is completely less left out the beliefs are not even mentioned etc etc it's this is why the, a lot of people are frustrated quite frankly because the teaching is incomplete so regurgitating somebody who had a completely incomplete coaching or whatever teaching and putting it in into their coaching adding nothing of their own is complete craziness it's craziness i tell you and yet a lot of people do it and they think they're doing a good fucking job it's like ridiculous to me so in some can you do it without a coach? Sure, you could. It, it might take you a very long time and you may or may not arrive at the same premise that you wanted to arrive. Um, if you had gotten a coach who you resonate with, once again, cannot stress this enough because it really has to resonate with you um, and who could have showed you um, the, you know, the shortcut towards everything that you need to do. And that's what it is because this payment that you're giving me is a contribution to what I can teach you. But ultimately, it's an investment and it's basically saying to the universe, I'm ready for the change. I'm going to take things seriously. And I know, listen, every single time somebody came to me and said, Anna, you know, I don't know if I can do this and the money and do 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 eventually, not eventually, inevitably, they would receive this money like within our coaching. I'm not even lying. Like with somehow, some way, something, something, two, but two, but two, and hoopla, the money's here. So that's because the universe is rewarding you for taking that leap of faith and taking things seriously and understanding this is more important than anything. So how much longer you want to remain in misery is entirely optional, right? So that's your decision. That's Completely. If you can do it, you can do it. But if there is a way for you to do it, I highly recommend it. Because to tell you completely the truth, and I've said this many, many times before, because it's the complete fucking truth. If 15 years ago, okay, when I was in my mid-20s and I was desperately seeking somebody, I went to a therapist, a couple of therapists that were, well, let, let me not even get started on that, completely, whatever, inadequate, let's just say it like that. I didn't get the help that I needed. And so I looked for a little bit for a coach. And I was so disappointed that even the most like well-known celebrity coaches, and I, you know, I I got a few meetings with uh, this one coach who, um, whatever, somebody gave me the number and blah, blah, blah. I was so disappointed because I saw firsthand like the hypocrisy and what I'm describing right now that internally they don't believe what they actually preach. So if you find a good one, that's, you know, congratulate yourself. I would have paid any fucking amount at that point to create a difference in my life. For somebody to literally take me by the hand and be like, here's what you do, here's how you do it. Like I said, I even teach people how to create a website for themselves in my coaching because I know like how much that information is needed for somebody to show you just this is how, the shortcut. You know, here's all the information, the amalgamation of all of my studying, all of my research, all of my coaching, and here's for you. Just take it, learn it, and run with it kind of deal. I would have paid any amount for that. I don't, I don't care even what I had to do. So again, the decision is yours. 
depending on how serious you are with that and how available you are towards a change, towards this revolution of your life, towards completely re-examining what you can become. Because who you are right now is not even, it's, it's not even the, the tip of the iceberg. You can become a complete superstar. And it doesn't mean necessarily that you, you know, that you have to want to become famous or ultra wealthy or whatever. A superstar simp- simply means the best version of yourself that you've ever been. And you know exactly how to manifest left and right. So with that, the decision is entirely yours. Like I said, if you want to do it on your own, you know, many people just watch videos, but understand also, <clears throat> here's the other thing I wanted to say. Watching a video, let's just say you watch a video about bringing back your SP, even if it's my own. Uh, although I do tend to think, and this is why I work so hard um, on delivering you the information, even if you're just on my channel, that it, it just cuts to the chase of the information that you really need. None of this blue, blah, blah. If somebody's talking in vague terms, they don't know what the fuck they're talking about. Side note here, um, meaning like Abraham Hicks and all, all the rest, you know, just kind of like they heard something somewhere and they just kind of like, they call it channeling. It's not fucking channeling, but let me not get into it. So watching somebody say something to you or listening to it, Um, is very, very different than being in a session with somebody who knows exactly how to help you because the video might not apply to you completely. Might in some ways, but not completely. But within your situation, there's an answer for a person who knows how the fuck to turn the shit around. So it's a completely different experience to completely address your issue Versus just hypothetically, vaguely talk about certain things that may or may not apply to you. So it, again, it, it's a question of time. How much time do you want to spend on this arriving to no results versus focus, do the work and then come out of it a superstar? It just be- becomes a question of time for me. I hope I answered this and helped um, somebody clarify this in their mind. But I do completely understand the animosity towards coaches because they don't have a good reputation. And again, I really do think you should be wise about where you invest your money and do the research. Like I said, I always say listen to more than one video of mine. Get familiar with my personality. I'm very direct. I'm unapologetically myself. I'm very confident in what I'm saying because I've lived it. Okay. It's as simple as that. Thank you very much for listening. Um, We will not have a live uh, tomorrow. Next week, we're going to be back on schedule. Uh, You can watch the live from Tuesday. It came out excellent. If I do say so myself, um, next week, we will be back on schedule having the lives on Saturday. Okay, but I'm pretty sure I'll pop in when, with another audio, this and that. I have channeled something last night, um, but I think I want to re-record this. Uh, but thank you so much for listening. All the information from me again is below. Until next time. Ciao, ciao.